and tears on the faces of many as they place flowers under the flag where Modesto Police Sergeant Mike Pershall lost his life. Very sad. Pershall was on his bicycle on Merrill Avenue around the corner from his Modesto home Tuesday evening when he was hit by a suspected drunk driver, Matthew Gibbs. It's difficult, it's difficult. But CHP investigators say 32 year old Gibbs was driving his Volkswagen when he struck the rear of the off duty sergeant's bicycle. Sergeant Pershall was thrown from the bike and died. Emergency personnel arrived on scene, located off duty, Sergeant Michael Pershaw lying in the roadway. Pershaw worked in Modesto since 2012. He was promoted to sergeant just a few weeks ago on August 8th. He worked in a variety of positions at the department. He was a field training officer, a canine handler, a hostage negotiator, and an advisor to the police explorer program. Michael's going to be very well missed in our community. Um, he was a leader. CHP officer Tom Olson says the suspect, Matthew Gibbs, is facing three charges, including murder. KCRA 3 has learned that Gibbs has been in trouble with the law before. Court documents show he was arrested for a DUI in 2012, but those charges were dismissed. Then in 2014 in Siskiyou County, he served a week in jail for a DUI and driving with a suspended driver's license. DUI collisions are 100% preventable. And what we had last evening was somebody who made a bad decision and got behind that wheel of that vehicle and took someone's life, took someone's father, took someone's husband, took someone's friend. You know, my children, bike ride, you know, could have been one of them. You know, could have been any one of us, you know. Some of Perchelle's friends tell us he was that go-to guy, the guy who would help anyone. We talked to some friends of Sergeant Perchell. They call him that go-to guy, that guy who would do anything to help anyone. Now he has a wife, Christina, and two sons, one in junior high school, one in high school. In Modesto, Melinda Meza, KCRA 3 News.